So the story behind this game started nearly a year ago. It was August 2014 when I learned that a family member was ill and I shut my eyes to send him healing energy and I realized it was as if I was imagining shooting his bad cells away like I was playing a video game. I've been designing 3D environments now for eight years and Dan's done video game development. So when I talked to him about what I imagined, we both decided we would make it a real video game. We've gotten such great feedback that we love all of the dialogue we've had and we've been able to improve the game so much. So we want to continue that dialogue online and we hope that you'll visit us on Steam and vote for us. In the meantime, we're going to keep using the suggestions and comments that we get and keep improving the game. Some of the improvements we've made, Dan can tell you about. We have a great new uh, effect for the shield so that when craft gets impacted by an enemy or uh, an obstacle, you see a nice distortion uh, around your ship and, and uh, a hexagonal energy field that warps around it. So that's really cool too. We've worked on the control system for the shop bot, so it's a lot easier to maneuver and know where you want to go and actually engage the enemies and destroy them. So it should make it a lot more fun to play. We've worked a lot on the sound design, we've worked on the gameplay mechanics, effects for the weapons, various effects for the enemies when they explode, and we're continuing to work on that. One of the things we did was add environmental sound, so it sounds like you're inside a fluid-filled underwater scene, and made better sounds for the weapon. We also made explosion sounds that actually are somewhat muffled, so they, they give the effect of being inside the liquid. The explosion effects are updated now with new particle systems, so they should look more cinematic. I've also been working on modeling a new boss enemy. This boss enemy is based on an ancient Egyptian goddess. That's what we love about the game. It has a lot of underlying mythology and symbolism. Circuit is based on an ancient Egyptian healing goddess. She's the scorpion goddess and she's in charge of helping heal scorpion bites. So this boss enemy is not only an enemy, but she's also an ally. For instance, when you defeat Circuit, you'll acquire a sniper that's on a turret that is her scorpion tail. We're trying to keep the game interesting by adding this underlying symbolism and mythos.